What's up guys, today's video is on the top 5 best Windows tablets in 2022 through extensive research and testing. I've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price, performance, or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. And now we present to you the best overall Windows tablet on the market in 2022. Meet the Microsoft Surface Pro 8. This model sports a 13-inch touchscreen display with a resolution of 2880 by 1920, a refresh rate of 120Hz, and compatibility with Dolby Vision, followed by a new generation components and connectivity that highlights its battery, which has a range of up to 16 hours. The Microsoft Surface Pro 8 tablet or laptop is a device that we can easily classify as premium because it has an adenized aluminum body that gives it a top-tier and durable design. In addition, the model comes ready for video conferences or video calls with its two cameras, the front one, which is full HD, and the rear one with 4K resolution, added with two studio-quality microphones and stereo speakers compatible with Dolby Atmos content. We must take into account that the product does not include the Microsoft Surface Pro keyboard, but it can be purchased separately. In the connectivity department, this model comes with two high-speed USB 4.0 Thunderbolt 4 ports, a combined 3.5mm audio jack, a Surface Connect port, and another for the Microsoft Surface keyboard, with the possibility of expansion if we buy a hub with more additional ports. On the component side, the Microsoft Surface Pro 8 comes with an Intel Evo Platform Core i7 processor that's suitable for use with everyday tasks such as office work, multimedia, web programming, video editing or graphic design without the 3D graphics load, accompanied by 32GB of RAM that goes well with this processor, as well as a 1TB SSD. The color section is very good and is supported by Dolby Vision HDR support and adaptive screen settings, which not only allow you to change the brightness, but also adjust the white balance and color temperature depending on the ambient light. Also, the keys are backlit and have a good size and space between them, which makes typing for hours very comfortable. The onboard battery provides an autonomy of almost 16 hours of use. Overall, this product delivers premium quality at the best possible price-quality ratio. You wanted the best, you got it. And now here we are with the silver medal and the title of the runner-up best Windows tablet on the market in 2022, the Microsoft Surface Pro X. This model is light, has a modern design, and has enough power to tackle any task. Microsoft Surface Pro X has everything it needs to gain a significant foothold in the market. This 2-in-1 convertible device retains the premium design that's been associated with the Surface brand since its first model. The company maintains its commitment to the metal back, which in the case of the Surface Pro X is only available in a matte black finish. The back retains the mirror effect Microsoft logo and the camera with a noise-canceling microphone in the center at the top. The choice of material is very much on point as it offers a solid and resistant look. At the top, we find the front camera, the Windows Hello infrared facial recognition system, and the front microphones. Thanks to a good job of compressing the frames, the screen has grown in this model, keeping the 3 to 2 format. Just above is the power button, while on the opposite side there are volume controls and two USB Type-C ports with Thunderbolt 3 features. They also allow you to charge devices and offer video output for external monitors. In this Surface model, the PixelSense display comes in a slightly larger size due to the narrowing of the front bezels. We're talking about a 13-inch touchscreen display with a 3-2 aspect ratio, a resolution of 2880 by 1920 pixels, resulting in 267 ppi. One of the features of Microsoft's PixelSense displays is a good level of brightness and color calibration. The 3-2 format is perfect for productivity because it allows more content to be displayed vertically something desirable when it comes to editing documents or when placing two open windows side by side. As for the processor, we have the Microsoft Surface SK-1 processor. Designed on the basis of the Qualcomm 8K for this device and has 8 cores at 3.0 GHz with a consumption of only 7 watts, the result is excellent performance. This is a quality product and all we can do is recommend it. Next, we present to you the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 tablet, which, in our humble opinion, is the best powerful Windows tablet on the market in 2022. Within the Lenovo X1 range, this new member of the team is a two-in-one type of player. The base model in many markets will be the one that integrates a Core M5 with 8GB of soldered RAM and a 128GB SSD. The design of this equipment is quite standard, 
without much personality, but it's robust, strong with a magnesium alloy finish, excellent dirt resistance, and above all, it's the lightest and thinnest compared to its brothers. The most interesting part, in addition to the keyboard, is the so-called productive module, which adds an HDMI port and another USB 3.0, as well as an additional battery and one Link Plus connection. There is also a module that turns the X1 tablet into a portable projector, which makes a lot of sense in a business and work environment where we can clearly frame this product. The keyboard is very comfortable, robust and light, despite the classic configuration and is not integrated into the cover. The ThinkPad keyboard includes backlighting, with two levels of intensity. Furthermore, in addition to the headphone jack and volume control, the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 tablet has a USB 3.0 port, USB-C for charging, a micro SD card slot, and a mini display port output. To emphasize the business focus of this model, there's a slot for a nano SIM card. This ThinkPad packs two cameras, an 8 megapixel main camera that can save us from any situation where we have to take photos, and a 2 megapixel secondary camera that records 1080p video. This Lenovo ThinkPad X1 tablet sports a 12-inch IPS panel with a resolution of 2160 by 1440 pixels, in line with its direct rivals. It also shares excellent and faithful color reproduction, contrast, viewing angles, and brightness with them. On that screen, we can use the pen included in the package with a 2-in-1 device. Thumbs up, that's for sure. The next product we'll talk about is the Asus VivoBook 13 Slate OLED which is quite rightly taken home the display of the best display Windows tablet in 2022. Aside from raw power or great features like dual screens, we can tell you that this is a device that surprised us the most in recent years. As soon as you take it out of the box, you have the impression of a very high-end product, but then you realize that it's really a mid-range product that has two first-class elements, the screen and the design. We're dealing with a two-in-one computer, which means we have full windows but in a tablet format that is very, very portable, but to which we can add a keyboard to make it ultra portable. The profile of the equipment is very thin, and on the right we have volume controls, the power button and fingerprint reader on the top, and the other connectors on the left. All this, of course, speaking from the point of the tablet horizontally, USB-A doesn't fit here, but we have two USB-Cs that also allow us to charge equipment and a micro SD reader. Asus decided to put OLED in a computer that, for its price, can fit into the mid-range. This panel makes the product shine. It's a 13.3-inch display that has plenty of bezels and a resolution of 1920 by 1080 pixels for a 16 to 9 format. It's touch-sensitive, pen-compatible, has HDR support, and a 60 Hz refresh rate. On the other hand, it has everything that makes OLED panels a favorite for many users, spectacular and very colorful. For content consumption, it makes a spectacular tablet, accompanied in addition by a good sound from four speakers that shows a top-tier level even with increased volume. And the brain is the Pentium Silver N6000, an Intel SoC that has a 10 nanometer lithography, four cores and four threads with a base frequency of 1.1 GHz and turbo up to 3.3 GHz. In a more realistic environment with 70-80% to 80 brightness and managing several tabs and programs such as Spotify or Slack, the battery delivers about six hours of work. Nice stuff. Off with the Microsoft Surface Go 3, the best compact Windows tablet on the market in 2022. The Surface Go 3 completes the refinement of the Windows tablet concept for the educational segment. The third iteration of the device comes to improve the lack of power that was so criticized in the previous version. As for the 10.5-inch diagonal, it's not noticeable at any time. Yes, it's true that you won't be able to have two windows open at the same time, but that's not something you need when you're taking notes with OneNote. In addition, we can always connect a larger external monitor for work. The versatility this form factor gives you at this size and weight is incredible. The device weighs only about 1.2 pounds. As for the screen, this model manages to take full advantage of Windows 11's color effects. Full HD resolution is more than enough for a 10.5 inch device, so we won't ask for more in this regard. The maximum brightness of about 400 nits makes multimedia consumption exceptional, although it seems short when we're outdoors. This is especially relevant if we also take into account the glossy finish. On the other hand, the automatic brightness adjustment works perfectly. The 10th generation Intel Core i3 proved more competent for basic office tasks, entertainment, and multimedia consumption. This model with 8GB of RAM can work with any web application. Microsoft Teams, TeamViewer, Visual Studio Code, WhatsApp, Unigram, and more. If we talk about storage, we must take into account that with the 128GB of internal memory, 
we'll have to have a cloud service like OneDrive to avoid charging the device. In any case, we can also use a micro SD card as a supplement. Good stuff. A thumbs up from here.